Wow. You see, Sniper... Oops. Sniper can hit through this obstacle. Finally, God damn it. Bum 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 bum. Dartling Gunner upgraded. Unlocked. Good. And round 40, guys. How easy will it be? Wow, the Moab piercing is pretty good. We have the limited edition trophy store items. I have 447 cups and I will buy all of them. Reindeer Moabs suck, to be honest. Wow, look at those brambles and stone! Look at the portal to the hell itself! Wow, people just waste your time saying how good the Dirtling Gunner is. Hello everyone, my name is Konstantin and today we are playing BT6 and the update 22.0 is live. It is 7 a.m. at my place, I have just woken up and we are making an amazing video for you. And this is the first time I've loaded the game, I've just ran through the patch notes quickly so that I can tell you everything you need to know about this update and when you finish watching this video you will know all you need and even more. Okay, update 22. Lo lock and load, everyone. Dartling Gunner is here. God damn. Wow, new skin. Look at this. Damn, this open. I want the skin now. And these are just stars on top of this massive holiday update. Dartling Gunner Tower complete with glorious tier 5 powers. Three Darling Gunners Monkey Knowledges plus five other new knowledges. Watch for penguins on chilly new beginner map skates. X marks with spot with classically challenging advanced map X factor. All new challenges. All, all new challenge browser complete with likes, favorites, and filters. Wow. To 20 festive new trophies items, trophy items, and 10 new achievements for holiday hunting. Okay, let's do the daily rewards so I can prove this is my first time I'm going here. Look, we need 500,000 pops for this one. I prepared in advance, that will be easy. Uh, I have around 201 here saved. Okay, let's do it. First overclock this dude. Then here, here, overclock factory. Good, and use the first strike, spam on them as much as possible. I think one round should be enough to destroy this and have enough pops. And what now? Okay, 200,000 already done, only with the sun god. And... This is still not the end of the round. Wow. Good. Keep on overclocking them. I think one round should be enough to open up this box. And... What? Okay, let's fast forward. Okay guys, in the process of completing 500,000 pops for the... Okay, where can we place the monkeys? I think over here. In the process of completing 500,000 pops to unlock the Dartling Gunner, I, I think I can remove this. Yes, and there's probably the water over here. To be honest, I didn't play BTD5 much in my life, so I, I know this map is from BTD5, but I have no such connection with this game to remember and know this. Okay, that's a pretty tough map, it wouldn't be funny to play it on champs, especially at the beginning, as we've just seen. Okay, and can I put anything on top of those? Okay, it seems like no, and I think I know the spots. First spot will be over here. Okay, wow, that's a pretty interesting map concept. I thought they would add only the beginner map, but 
this advanced map is pretty interesting. Um, the balloons go from here to hero, here. <coughs> Sorry, they go back and forth, back and forth, and this is pretty interesting. We haven't seen this concept in BTD6 before. Okay, I will use the ninjas. To pu I'll put them over here. One of them, ninja plus alchemist, over here, and the other one from the right side. Then I'll start start farming. I also I want to see uh, how this map works, and then we'll be able to farm more and unlock like all the Easter eggs on this map. And you can also expect chimps mode on this X map pretty pretty soon uh, on my channel. I think one or two days, and I will upload it for sure. I'll be also uploading the beginner map chimps. I think today probably we're gonna see. Okay, let's speed up the process, and I will show you the ending of this game. Okay guys, now we have the solid income and let's remove this obstacle. Okay, and that's the dynamic. <laughs> I didn't expect this thing, can we fit the farm here? We can fit the sniper with the vision of everything. Wow, you see, sniper, oops, sniper can hit through this obstacle um, after removing it. So far that's what I've seen. That's interesting. Okay, I think I wanna try adding Super Monkey here. But first, let me add some more defenses because we will need them for sure. Two ninjas should be enough. Yes, okay. Because I don't wanna think much. Right now, I wanna just feel the map if you know what I mean. Okay, I like this map so far. It's like it's sim in terms of my liking. It's very similar to Mesa. Mesa was a very good map when they added it. Uh, it still is. It's very interesting map. That's not as easy as the other ones. One of the harder advanced maps, and this one will be one of the hardest advanced maps for sure. And on champs mode, of course. That's what. It drags my interest into this. That's very, very good. Okay, let's fast forward to round 80 and then we will see. Okay guys, it's round 78, the middle of this round. For this little walkthrough, my goal was to put as many farms on this map as I humanly can to demonstrate to you uh, how many spots we have, because I think that's the most useful utility of time that we have right now in this update video, so that you can immediately start uh, like bordering this map. Also a good thing, uh, you can put the super monkey in the middle and if you put the alchemist or in this spot or in this spot under the village alchemist should be able let me ch check alchemist sh on the top spot i'm 100 percent confident that he will be able to no the bottom spot is not working but the top spot alchemist will alk above the super monkey good so you've seen the spots now i'm gonna sell the farms to buy the Bloom Master Alchemist and we are good. Good. Home. Then uh, let's open the Dirtling Gunner. 5000 more pops, okay? Okay. Then we're going to Impopable. I don't understand from what pops do, does this game count because it's pretty damn stupid. I popped at least, I would say. 15 million balloons while uh, playing on the rounds past round 200, but 
it was still not enough for them. So I think completing round 203 should be enough to satisfy their need in our pops. Okay, let's overclock those even more. Okay, this is a pretty leggy <laughs> walkthrough because it's round 203, but we don't care. Okay, probably this should be sufficient. I hope so, at least. One round, one round is all we need. Do it. It's still, it's still funny to look at the late game. So, let's do it. And we are almost done. Some balloons and be on the back of the track, okay. And do we have 5,000 more pops? Finally, goddammit. Bum 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 bum. Dartling Gunner upgraded, unlocked. Good. Okay, Monkeys Military Dartling Gunner. Okay, I will make a separate video for the Dartling Gunner to sh demonstrate all the paths and how they work and the strategies with them. Uh, for now, I have just unlocked it. I will demonstrate it to you. Uh, for example, on this new map. Uh, I think with Monkey Knowledge you should be able to put it down. And the hotkey for it is M. Uh, right, the next hotkey from the Dirtling Gunner. Okay, as you can see, it's turning pretty slow. The, wow, I love this map. It's so... how to say it's... It's so sweet. That's <laughs> this, the word I have for this map. Look, the little penguins. Uh, the, I don't think we have we ever seen the penguins on the map. We've seen the seagulls, but those are just amazing. Okay. And also, the best way to farm XP for the towers is to place them, as, as many of them as possible. Uh, and but at the end of the round, you will get more XP because of that. As you can see, I already got the some XP points. Focused firing, faster swivel. Okay, faster swivel would be greater. Of greater use for us. Okay, focused firing unlocked. And let's do focused firing as well. It costs 255. Good. I will fast forward this one too because I really want to play <laughs> with Darling Gunner myself. But as you can see, uh, they, when you upgrade the faster swivel, they can follow your mouse much, much better. As you can see now. And now upgrade powerful darts. And I also need another one of those. Okay, I should spam more zero zero zeros because they generate you more XP. God damn it. Look at those cute penguins. Wow. That's that's my new favorite map for this update. Uh, in terms of the design. So really so sweet and the gingerbread cookie man is resting in the pond. Wow, the designer of this map, shout, I, I, I would love to give a shout out to this guy, it's so damn good. Okay, let's do it. And round 40 guys, how easy will it be? Wow, the Moab piercing is pretty good. Uh, I just want to test the 101 and 0110 uh, Dartling Gunner spam. Okay, the next step is we have the limited edition trophy store items. I have 447 cups and I will buy all of them. Okay, happy holidays. Then Santa's heads. Good. Red nose decal. Custom power retro tag bot. Then power, custom power bumble, bubble mine. Okay, monkey village elf pet. Then boomerang candy. Then present, 
presence placement and upgrades effects okay these are some limited time avatars good regardless of what those are they are limited time and <laughs> i will buy them for sure and the penguin snowman penguin pet fasty okay it's for pet fasty with the snow skin okay and we have the new <gasps> new urban skin wow let's test it very quick i wanna show it to you okay okay damn i need to use ben not the ben but open for this this is the best skin so far. The devil skins are always so good. Okay, and wow, look at this horns. Okay, he's become more scarier. And look, he grows horns as he levels up. Okay, let's do round 15, for example. And now we see the reindeer mobs. We also see the Santas, <laughs> Santa hat, ceramics, and wow, reindeer mobs suck to be honest. Wow, look at those brambles and stone! Look at the portal to the hell itself! Wow, I did not expect this. Okay, let's take a look at all of those. Reindeer skins suck. Right in the comment section if you think so as well because uh, they ju they're, they're just garbage I will switch them to my Halloween skins back or I will wear the cylinder head because look this is a horrible skin okay we tested that out now let's test new pets um, pet guys also NK released the um, okay, and there you go. There is our penguin pet. Pet's pet. That's so weird to say. Oh, this guy is so cute. It's like a brother of those, but with the cylinder. That's his style. Okay, and what we also have here is new achievements. Okay, spend at least 50 trophies in the trophy store, collect, and... 25 trophies, good. Purchase at least one limited time item, good. We have unlocked two of them just by purchasing. Pop 1 million balloons with Dirtling Gunners, easy. Uh, upgrade towers 20,000 times, easy. Uh, new secret achievement, good. You can expect it, expect it in, the, in a few days on my channel, so subscribe now, not to miss it. Host and win 10 co-op games, easy. Uh, strip the fortification from DDTs 3000 times, no problem. Submit a challenge, easy. Use tier 5 Insta Monkey. Note, even after being used, Intas will still count towards your collection. Ah, uh, that's a. I will make this achievement like. In, I can do it right now, why not? Okay, uh, let's do it. We need to use Insta. No, let's, let's rather do the hard mode at least. We need to use uh, tier 5 and Stamonkey. I have some of those. I don't want to spend my heli. What are those that I can waste? Okay, let's waste the engineer. It's tier 5, it's super balloon trap. Good. Now and... So, now I've just... I will... Let's do one round with this one put the pet faster down and yes we completed the first round and let's see now i will collect a brand new fifth tier this is the only achievement that gives you fifth tier insta monkey as a reward and we get the monkey village it's much worse than my engineer but still this i don't think i had this one previously in my collection let's look at it monkey village yes that's the second fifth tier the different one so those achievements are not as hard and we can destroy them i think in one or two days so just use 100 insta monkeys um that's also pretty simple 
just use the <laughs> what the gray ones green ones or blue ones me personally i have tons of them so i will do this achievement maybe i will make a walkthrough of the maps using only insta monkeys because now we have the achievement that requires us to use 100 instas and let's check the profiles profile pictures this one looks dope to me uh I, this church angry church was still, still my favorite but i will rock with this one for now it's positive and amazing and now guys the most important part of the update uh they also added monkey knowledge points let's buy them immediately okay activate it okay boost their swivel speed okay hydro rocket storm st damages stun damages balloons okay where plasma and doom beams cross on the track they create temporary plasma pools wow this will be useful for sure okay then the next one sniper monkey sub buccaneer attack 10 percent faster when they set to last targeting priority wow i did not expect this one that's interesting uh always set your buccaneer on last with this monkey knowledge no magic monkey knowledge that's added up okay then purchase price of first pack factory each game is 150 less I will go to this and the balance changes you will see why this is a necessary monkey knowledge okay and heroes receive five percent more experience per each hero placed okay that sounds pretty weird it, it's the co-op right? monkey knowledge then we have monkey money cost entry races reduced by 10 percent wow 100 percent buy it this is the best powers uh, monkey knowledge so far and uh, i think i've just bought everything yes everything is bought i still have a lot of monkey knowledge points 14 on level 155 and that's good no of none of those are game breaking but they are a good addition and finally the balance changes uh, i will first i will tell them very fast to you so that you can know everything you need okay uh first also one thing on the odysseys they allowed the path restrictions for the towers th that we can choose to make them harder and this is amazing okay uh first thing is the balloon impact it was nerfed all the top tiers are nerfed a bit in terms of damage next thing is ring of fire price was reduced by 1000 so that it's a good buff then Mo moab press price slightly increased but not by much only 200 dollars uh then Glue, the middle path was was buffed, but not by much, so you st it still sucks. Next, sniper was buffed. The shrapnel shots are improved even further, and now cripple mob is being buffed significantly by the shrapnel shots. You still should use even faster firing with it. Okay, ballistas. That's a pretty good update because they re returned the attack speed of ballistas to 1.3 seconds and it will significantly buff the ballistic missile and the strategy where you spam ballistics on chimps will return that's amazing then uh buccaneer base price was reduced from uh 500 to from 550 to 500 it's will it will be much easier to place this one on chimps then um ace had been changed slightly like the flying fortress price was reduced but it's not a big deal it will not affect game as much uh helicopter was nerfed the mob show now is not as good as showing the mobs okay mortar uh middle path was buffed like two times but it's still a not very good upgrade then uh, Super Monkey Middle Path was also buffed. Technological Terror is cheaper, and the Balloon is, and the Robo Monkey especially is two thousand cheap dollars cheaper, and they deal more damage. Then Spike Factory nerf. The, why they had to do this to us? Spike Factory nerf. Mm, they should have buffed it, not nerfed it. Okay, Spike Factory base price is increased by two hundred dollars. 
but the white hot spikes price is reduced by 150 but this doesn't matter to us because oh no, not the base price the bigger stack price sorry um i was too set for this okay bigger stack price or the base yeah, wait 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 let's check it out first Okay, the hard mode is the regular price for the Spike Factory. How much money is it? 715. Okay, uh, this is with monkey knowledge on. No, the base price did not change, but the price of the bigger stacks changed. <sighs> okay, base price would be so horrible. Okay, the 100 price plus $200 and Gwendolyn was also buffed, now the cooldown on her passive ability was reduced from 15 seconds to 4.5 seconds. So Gwen will buff all the towers around her and she will do it almost permanently. And the last thing that I want to mention is the same thing, Spike Factory, the life of the base um, spikes that spike factor produces was 70 seconds right now it's it is reduced to 50 seconds this is also a pretty significant nerf so unfortunately nk thought that this tower is too op i disagree completely it was not as used it wasn't used as much and we need the to buff this dude uh, Spike Factory is amazing. Okay, tell me your thoughts guys about the Dirting Gunner right now. I will make a separate video and it will go live in a day or two where I give the constructive feedback on all of those and we will make a chimp strategy using the Dirting Gunner shortly. Hit the like button right now, subscribe to my channel and hit the bell notifications icon down below not for, for not to miss the new updates and new content on my channel guys share this video with your friends so that they can know everything they need to know about the updates as far as i know nobody can show you the fetch notes as i did and people just waste your time saying how good the dirtling gunner is see you in the next one